previously on Maddie's Glam Life. And hopefully she gives me some good news. Cause it's indeed the Monica Lewinsky. This right here is the native moisturizing conditioner. The morning of a show can be quite stressful and also very busy for any entertainer. In order to pick myself up for the rest of the day, I love to start off any day that I'm getting ready to get on the road off with my Banish skincare line. Now Banish offers an array of different products that helps so much with the skin. If you guys have been watching my journey, you already know how far Banish has brought my skin. And y'all know that I have to pop in and share with you guys the items that I am absolutely loving. If you are struggling with acne, hyperpigmentation, or anything that affects your self-confidence with your skin, look no further. Banish has the right answer for you. You can use my code MADDIE to save $5 off any purchase of $50 or more. Yes, honey, your girl is saving you a few coins. So check out that link below and get on the Banish bandwagon because it is something that you absolutely will not regret at all. My girl, we roll our hips and take my sip on it Take a trip on it When I girl, you can go slow Wind it up on night Baby, take your time Let me know fam welcome to the vlog this video is going to be a weekend in the life of an entertainer um we are going to arkansas on today um so that's what i'm all dressed up for i need to go get my oil actually so that i can put some oil on my legs because i got on shorts and i don't want nobody like oh she a little ashy okay my room is a mess you guys because it's always a mess whenever we're about to hit the road this stuff right here the business okay you need this in your life okay and my camera won't even focus this stuff is the business it's by vaseline and it is body oil of course so i'm gonna put some of this on really quickly try to make sure that these legs are nice and oiled and they're wearing all white. Who follows the rules, okay? I don't want to wear white shit. My camera. Okay. Let me be great, camera. Anyways, who wants to wear all white? I never want to wear all white. I hate wearing white. With a passion. So I'm going to put some of this on my legs. So it can be nice and shiny. So everyone can see that I'm a golden goddess. Yes, hey. Nothing better than some freshly shaved legs and some oil. Period. Okay, you guys. Um, I need to figure out if there's something else that I want to put in my bag. Anyways, this is an outfit of the day. Super duper cute. This cardigan, I guess you can call it, or kimono, is from Fashion Nova. 
um i love the sleeves on it as for my jewelry i really only have this bracelet here which is my birthstone of course um i'm an aquarius so that's my birthstone my apple watch my ring sorry right now i'm married okay <laughs> and um yeah this bodysuit here i think i got it at mad rag um and then these shorts i showed in my last fashion haul i guess it's my last fashion haul at this point and these are from fashion nova like these are on the rise up all day yeah anyways you guys super duper cute um real simple real simple today and i love it oh and my shoes are from rec room rec room is that you i think my shoes are from rec room but anyways i'm gonna see because i might put on a necklace honey who knows who knows um but yeah that's pretty much it for right now i'm gonna throw this in my purse of course i'm probably going to need this all right y'all so we pulled over on the side of the road we're in tunica and um yeah a day in the life of an entertainer the oil light jumped on so now they're tending to that no oil recap of this weekend this weekend was extremely fun okay um and we have to do it all over again next weekend and the weekend after that and the weekend after that so you guys are going to be getting vlogs back to back to back of a, a weekend in the life of an entertainer because i promise you it gets so crazy around these parts being an entertainer it's just like oh my gosh like your life is consumed with being on the road okay um this weekend we did have some technical difficulties um the van was actually in the shop okay so typically we travel in a van all of us together um but the van was in the shop and they didn't finish whatever was wrong with it before such time that we got ready to leave so it was still in the shop at the time that we went on this tour date but the next tour date 
the babies will be back um we're going to illinois next week so you guys stay tuned for that but yes i had a lot of fun my braces are really like cutting the top of my mouth up here all of a sudden i'm not sure why but we're going to Cairo, Illinois next week. So I'm on next weekend. So I'm going to vlog that for you guys. And um, yeah, but it's a very lengthy process being an entertainer. It definitely takes a lot of hard work and dedication as with anything. And um, you really have to be someone that um, is driven to do music and entertainment. Like I tell everybody. Um, and of course, that's with anything in life. So <sighs> yes, you guys. Stay tuned for the next vlog that will be going up. Um, I won't say next weekend, but next week. Um, and you guys can see, you know, a little bit more of my life. But other than that, I hope that you guys enjoyed the vlog. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Because like I said, if you're not liking, if you're not subscribing, if you're not commenting, honey, you're not supporting, okay? Um, today has just been a crazy day. There is, There was this guy here in Memphis that was just walking up to random people and just shooting them okay so uh you all know it's only so much that you can say here on youtube but it has definitely been crazy around these parts so i've just been in the house my family has basically been in the house and we've just been watching like what the hell is going on um and doing it on facebook live too so thankfully they called him i think he ended up shooting like five people so y'all continue to pray okay for your family to be safe, for everyone that you love to be safe, because y'all, it is crazy out here in these streets, and wow, we need to focus more on mental health. I know that that's something that we tend to brush under the rug, but mentally, a lot of people definitely do need help, okay? Um, and that's basically all that I can say about that, you know? Man, oh man, <laughs> it's rough out here.